Hello, good morning. It's Saturday and I would like to start off this vlog by reading this message that I got on Instagram. So I posted this picture yesterday after stream. Nothing too scandalous. Just says, hey, thanks for a great stream. It's just a normal picture, okay? This is the message I get. <clears throat> and I died, I died. Hiya, beautiful. Would you have any possible interest in selling foot content? Down to discuss a couple hundred dollars weekly. <clears throat> I mean, it's a yes for me, right? I'm <laughs> just kidding, but yeah, so I thought that was funny. Um, and I laughed very, very hard about it um, uh, as a result. Anyways, welcome back to the theater. It is as I said, Saturday. Hopefully it won't be too crazy of a shift. This, this last week I've been working more than I would like. <laughs> Just like. Listen, here's the thing. I'm like, I was streaming last night and I was like, I worked longer than I would have liked to. I worked for seven hours yesterday. I know people work like eight hours consistently, but for me, anything like, it's so like four hours is my call time. So like four hours is the ideal shift. Five hours is okay. Anything over five hours, I'm like, this is just too much work. And, <laughs> and like, I'm lucky that I'm obviously in a position where I don't need to work full time. Um, it's great for the mental health. <laughs> but yeah, it's kind of, kind of I'm kind of ridiculous and I get it. Anyways, a stream last night, um, Fall Guys, it was all right. I was like, I was in a mood and then my internet was like, Oh, or my stream, I don't really know what it was, was like, oh, you want to be live? <laughs> JK, no. <laughs> and then it would come back up and it'd be like, oh, don't worry, got you. <laughs> JK, no. <laughs> so that was a bit of a pain, but that's okay. Like, I didn't get off work until 3.30 yesterday, and then I had fabric to cut because the other day I've been cutting fabric, and I was like, I need to cut this fabric before... Like, so we can have the dining room table back. So I finished cutting the fabric, which was nice, but then, like, it was probably, like... 4.30 by that point, that I had to put on makeup to get ready and then I had to feed myself. So like yesterday was like a wash, um, but today is a new day. I've got so much stuff on my list. I was feeling a little anxious yesterday or, or something. Like I've been having trouble focusing the last couple days. Like my poor little brain is going boop, 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 boop. And so I'm like, is it because I haven't made a list? So I tried to make a list yesterday because like I was like borderline meltdown. Like the last two days I've been getting like overwhelmed sensorily. <laughs> Sensory overload, I think is what it is. Um, Cause I've been like right on the edge of a meltdown twice in the last two days, which is not ideal. So I'm hoping that having a list will be better. We, we don't have to, we have a lot on the list today, but not all of it needs to get done. I w put up a couple clips yesterday, last night for my YouTube clip channel. So like, that's good. So that's, I've got a couple days buffer. Um, and then I have other stuff that can still be uploaded and then I have other stuff that just needs to be converted Or like slightly edit it to get uploaded. So it's just there's a lot I think is the problem and I have vlogs I need to edit So today is gonna be like work try to get out here as quickly as possible Go have a nap do invoicing because we're not behind on that, but we're not ahead on that um, Worst case scenario we can do it tomorrow and then uh, did I say editing already? And then I have to, I'm on a podcast tomorrow, so we have to do a test run on the Discord call. So they, we got a lot, but not a ton, if that makes sense. Anyways, I'm rambling for no reason. I should probably start work, but I don't know. Oh, also I woke up this morning and I had a Taylor Swift song stuck in my head. I don't remember which one. I was like, that's weird, as I was like, you know, getting ready in the morning. And then it switched to the, the sea shanty. You know, there once was a ship that put to sea, that one. It stuck in my head, so I don't, I don't know. And I woke up and my body felt like I'd worked out yesterday and I clearly did not, I'm just falling apart. So a couple weeks ago, I noticed this cobweb in the theater house and like, there it is. It's super high, okay? Like, I'm 5'6", I'm nowhere near it nowhere near it. And I was talking to my boss and he's like, oh yeah, I noticed it too. I'm like, I don't even know how you would get that down. Cause it's like, it's not like we can get our scissor lift into the house because it's on the stage. And it's not like there's a ramp off the stage, it's stairs. And he's like, oh, I think you get it down with just a broom. <laughs> and I was like, if I could javelin the broom up there, like there's no way he's like, don't worry. Me and the techs will take care of it. <laughs> Still there. Anyways, I am 
just about done for the day. Um, there's still a few things I need to do, but um, we've actually got a little bit of a lull. We have like two nights with no shows and I'm in for my regular admin shift on Tuesday and it's not gonna take like the entire day. So I figured I'll just split some of this stuff to that day so that I can just work for four hours. And I think I'm gonna get some food and then probably have a nap. I'm feeling better. I listened to the same song on repeat for a couple hours <laughs> and my brain is less overstimulated. I think it's just cause I'm tired um, and doing too much. I think it's a combination of those things and so my brain just can't deal with it. So it's just constantly on the verge of too much sensory input slash overload slash meltdown. So that's great, but we've brought it back a bit. It's still there. It's like right here, right here. It's like I can feel it right there in my brain. Um, so I feel like if I have a comfort food and I have a snack and I have sleep, the comfort food is a snack, and I have a sleep, hopefully when I wake up, my body and brain will be like, we good. So that's the plan but I should pack up my bag because it is almost time to depart. Good morning, and by morning, I mean afternoon. I crashed so hard when I got home from work. I grabbed food on the way home. I'm like, oh yeah, I'm just gonna have a nap. And so it was like probably like 12.30ish, quarter to one. And so I was like, okay, like I'll set an alarm for like three, and then like 3.05, 3.10, 3.15, 3.30. Um, the first one went off and I turned everything off except for the 3.30 one, and then I guess the 3.31 went off. I was like laying in bed. I was like, well, how much longer do I have? It was like 3.34. So anyways, I'm awake now. My arms hurt and my hands hurt. And I'm wondering if it's actually like too much video gaming. <laughs> because sometimes my hands will hurt if I'm using a controller for too long. And I've been, you know, streaming a fair amount lately. I don't feel like it's that much. Maybe it's a combination. Um, but I'm going to go, I think, put some chicken in the crock pot. Because I want some shredded chicken. Um, to like bring to work and snack on and stuff and then I need to figure out what to do for dinner. My mom's at work So it's just me and her boyfriend and we're notoriously bad for finding something good to feed ourselves with. Okay, we are definitely making some Moves things are happening. I don't know. It's 530 now. So I've been a bit slow, but I got my shredded chicken on I took out the garbage that was in my room and I rewrote my list so one it's a little bit better and two it looks nicer like it's if I'm editing multiple vlogs, I like to put like edit vlogs and then go one, two, three, four, or however many there are so I can cross them off. So I feel more, it's more satisfying. I'd say with thumbnails and stuff. So that is good. Feeling better about that. I'm going to try to get one vlog edited here quickly and then um, cook some dinner. going to do grilled cheese because I was like, hey, wait, that's like low effort, but high reward. <laughs> and then um, again, I think I'm just going to sit here like all night, my butt here just trying to get as much video editing I can do done. And I want to do invoicing as well. I have to send my invoice for invoicing. We're like almost a week into this month and I would, I should, you know, send that so I can get paid. Um, and then a ton of, ton of clips and then I have shred chicken and stuff. So it's just, it's going to be a big day and I want to like deal with this a little bit. So it's not that bad. I need to put the, I mean, it's bad because I have so much fabric and I don't know what to do with it. Um, but I need to put the dirty clothes in the hamper and that should make things better and then we'll see how I feel like I've just I think part of the reason I've been feeling like so uh, for the last couple days is I just haven't had a plan of attack um, so hopefully fingers crossed the plan of attack and also um, accomplishing things will make me feel better alrighty so it is just before six and we are one vlog down and I believe let me actually double check um, while we're here so two. yeah so I think it is four which was what I guessed so I just did October 29th and then the 30th and 31st are together and then the first is a separate one and the third is a separate one so hopefully we can get that done pretty quickly um I think I'm gonna take a pause from this not that I've done a lot of work here um and go cook dinner and then we'll come back and we will continue on and probably after dinner edit one video and then do invoicing and at some point among all this um we're gonna be doing a, a whatchamacallit 
I'm doing a test call with the person who I'm on a podcast with tomorrow. Um, I texted or messaged him. I was like, hey, do you want to, like, do a test call? He's like, oh, it's just going to be a Discord call. I'm like, yeah, but, like, you can get, like, everything set up. It's the first episode, which is, like, kind of stressful that he, like, picked me. Um, but kind of cool. But, yeah. So I also need to make sure that I have, I have somewhere a list of my top five games. Um, and it is not here. So we should find it. <laughs> I know, I know them. So it's Fall Guys, Islets, um, Sackboy, A Big Adventure. I'm thinking Rogue Heroes. What was the other one? Shoot, I need to find my list. Okay. What was the other one? <laughs> well, my computer is restarting. I just finished dinner. Woke up my computer because it was on sleep mode. Started loading things into my editing program. And it crashed. It's a different error code than it was like last week when it was doing this. So, I think I, reluctantly, I think I might need to just check my RAM, like, physically, but, like, I haven't touched it, so it's not, like, because, like, look for physical damage, but, like, I haven't moved it in, like, two years, so, I don't know. Anyways, let's get these glasses on and, um, see what we can troubleshoot. So annoying. I'm just trying to get stuff done. I mean, thank goodness it never crashes. Um, while I'm streaming, like, knock on, knock on wood for that one, but I just, I don't understand what it is. I'll have to run another, like, scan disk check and see if I can resolve this. Super annoying. Oh, shoot. I just remembered I was vlogging. So, here's how things went. I edited two, one vlog, had dinner. I can't remember the last time I made up the camera. Edited, started editing what I thought was two days into one vlog, but it's actually two days. My bad. Um, and so that took me a little bit longer than intended. And then I got together with the guy who's running the podcast I'm going to be on tomorrow. And boy, did we have to troubleshoot a lot. So it was like video, video. I was like visual. That works too. Um, it was like the video um, trying to get my stuff in and sized which went pretty quick but then there's something wrong with his capture part on his camera so <laughs> we were troubleshooting and troubleshooting and troubleshooting and that went on for like probably 20 minutes or so and finally I was like okay well why don't you go troubleshoot this independently like I'm gonna be at my computer for a while so like whenever you're ready just call me back and so he called me back I think like 15 or 20 minutes later and then so we had that problem resolved and then all of a sudden his audio stopped working through Discord, but it was working in his OBS. Um, so I helped him troubleshoot that. Turns out I'm very good at troubleshooting. And then um, after we do the podcast, we're going to play Fall Guys together. And so he has a screen for that. So we'll have both of our cameras or both of our pictures up or our video feed. Um, and so we went over there for like <laughs> the camera was way off on me. His went great, though. That was good. And then... Uh, so we got that sorted, but I was like, shoot, that might mess up the original one. And so I was like, okay, well, like, you can just use, like, a, a screen to be like, we're transitioning. And he's like, oh, I've never done that. And I was like, wait, like, go to that side, use studio mode. So, like, the way OBS works, I assume, same as Streamlabs, um, you can have just one single screen up. And that is what is live, that is what is going, or you can open up... Um, what's called studio mode in OBS. I'm not sure what it's called in Streamlabs, but you can have two different screens up. So you have your live screen, which is what is currently broadcasting. I'm pretty sure this is what they do for TV and stuff. And then you have your preview screen, um, where you set up your shot, you get what you want, you make sure everything's set, sitting over here. Live screen, preview screen, live screen, <laughs> preview screen. Um, so I was like, oh, just do that. And then that way, if, like, the camera gets out of sync and, like, you can open your game and then you can just, once you're happy, you can just transition over while we're, like, still chatting. He was like, wow, I didn't know about that. So I was like, that's pretty awesome considering I don't use that program because I don't like it. I was able to help him do that and I was able to help with a bunch of troubleshooting. So I'm really glad I suggested that we do this the night before 
because imagine like it took like an hour imagine if we like only signed in like 15 minutes early tomorrow and it, it, it's been uh, terrible so I'm glad that we did that and then he also gave me a bit better rundown of what to expect from the podcast so I spent a little bit of time working on um a document like I I knew what I want to say but I liked about the games but then he was like well I'm gonna say like some things I didn't like and I'm probably like far less critical than he's gonna be because like one I'm like I haven't played this enough to have cons and another one is like I just this game is too short that's the biggest con <laughs> um so yeah so I've got that going I feel better and then so tomorrow I'll probably get up around like 8 or 8 30 reluctantly wake up have a breakfast drink do my makeup make my stupid waffles put on my waffle shirt and which I made specifically in case I decide not to make waffles and then um we'll go so that should be exciting I think it'll be good um and he says there's gonna be a quiz too so I'm a little bit concerned about that but I'm sure it'll be fine and um yeah anyways I think I'm gonna go to sleep now it's raining quite heavily so I think I should probably close my window um but I hope you have a fantastic amazing wonderful evening, day, night, whatever time it is where you are. And I was like, did I just say all, was it was like night, evening, midnight. No, I did say day in there. And um, I'll hopefully I'll see you in the next one. <laughs> Good night.